breezy this year with the wind. It was definitely a little breezy and chilly this year, so I was trying to kind of get behind some of the men if I could. But um, I'd say it was maybe a few seconds slower, conditions-wise, than last year, but still a good course and still a good morning. Did you feel about the same as last year, strength-wise, how fresh you were? Yeah, I'd say about the same. I just wasn't um, dragged as quickly out the first mile and a half. Maybe that was the difference. Uh, but I think I don't feel too bad now, so similar to last year. Can you tell us a little how the race went? Because, you know, not all of us can see everything. You know, you know. Um, I went right to the front and around, we were through the K in like 3.03 or so. I heard someone's watch go off and then around the mile, <clears throat> around the mile, I tried to get up behind some of the men to block the wind and that's when the pack faded back. Um, and then I was just kind of chasing a few of the men from there. Was that your, your game plan then? Yeah, I just wanted to run as hard as I could and um, the, the guys in front of me were just a little too far ahead so I was just trying to reel them in and use them as a target. Yeah. Yeah. Behind me, the last I heard, I think around a mile, we started to separate, uh, maybe 2K. So, where are you at with your training right now? Um, just kind of getting into track shape and doing a little bit of faster stuff now. And I'll go up to altitude in May and do some, uh, a month of really hard work before Prefontaine. Whereabouts? In Flagstaff. Yeah. Happy with the effort today? Was there anything you still would have, else you would have liked to get out of it? Um, I'm happy enough with it. Um, yeah, I don't usually run as fast myself as I do in like a deep race, so I expected it to be a little slower than last year, but it's good. Is it a big goal coming back to defend the title? Yeah, yeah, definitely. I like this race. I like the timing of it. Um, the course is fast, which I always like a PR course, so it would have been nice to run a little faster today, but I need to, I need to be dragged to that time. <laughs> what are you running in the free 5K? The 5K, yeah. Do you have like a goal in mind uh, just face some of the women I hope to see should I make the Olympic team. Uh, I think there will be a really good African field, so I just want to run against them. That will be the only time I'll get to race an international field before the Olympics if I make the team. Right. So, I mean, do you think if they go out, do you think breaking your PR, you know, correct, would that be a play? Do you think it would be in that kind of shape? Um, that will be the goal. I, um, I hope it will be hard to get sharp at altitude, so we'll have to do like a 1500 at some point before I go, but um, that would be nice. Yeah, it's just a little early, but it's What was the wind like out there? Was there any particular point in the course when it really hit you? <laughs> um, on the, the stretch coming back, it, there were a few gusts that were pretty, they were pretty cold. Actually, my arms got pretty cold. Um, Is that down Boylston Street? Yeah, heading down Boylston. Uh, there are a few really windy patches. The way out was nice. You got the benefit. Congratulations. Thanks.